three pounds of beef shank. <laughs> Onions, one whole onion. Just keep throwing them. Garlic cloves, or as many as you want, but five is the right number. Onion powder, just a little bit. Minced onions, just a little bit. Feel me? Right there. Different type of peppers that I don't know the name of. Bring them to a boil. Two of these. I'll remove this. I'm gonna put them in here. Add water, one cup of water, or toilet water, whatever you prefer. For you nasty creeps out there. This is how it's gonna look. Can't do it. Mix, blend, and it's not working. Next oh, blend. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Oh. Oh. Ooh, this has uh, Yo, just use one of these little thingies that has a hole, and then you're just gonna dump your sauce like this. You see, just in case of any, you know, wiggle it. Make sure you take the excess, whatever is there. Don't eat it. Okay, this is how it should look. This is how it should look after you're done. Ooh, two tablespoons of this beef, you know, okay. Three of these. A teaspoon of oregano. I ain't have a lot, so yeah. Add a pinch of cinnamon. Yeah, that tastes good. Half a tablespoon of salt. And you're gonna need more salt than this, but while you're cooking it, you're gonna have to taste it. Four cups of water. Let's go boil this on high for two to three hours. It's gonna be falling off the bone now. That's how it's gonna look. It's gonna fall off the bone. Okay, now you're gonna chop it up. You know, let me chop it up and then I'm gonna show you again. This is how it's gonna look when it's all chopped up. This is just one. Take some of the oil from your meat, whatever, you know, put it to the side a little bit. You're gonna need to cover, no. You're gonna need some of this oil to um, put some on uh, the tortillas itself. What you do is, you grab the sauce that I told you to take from the meat. You, you know, I already did this process. Take a little bit of cheese, and then you come back over here, just flip it. And you're gonna come fast. This process, you gotta do it fast. Make sure you get the whole thing, cause you want it to be set in color. Grab a little bit more cheese. A little bit more. Some meat. Be generous, you bastards. Right there's good. Right here, don't overpack it because then it's gonna be hard to close. Boom. This is the final product. You know I'm not a chef or nothing, but it looks great. Have a great day and have a good night, bro.